Hi YouTube! So, I'm gonna do a video that's gonna be a little bit new. Um, usually I do no videos on this channel, but today I am diving deep into the world of planners. Um, I know that probably doesn't ring a bell with some of you, but then I know some of you, I'm sure it does. I know being a nail tech, we usually really rely on having a schedule and then we also have to budget our money. So I've always been a, a, a list maker. And so in this video, I am going to show you this crazy world that I just dove into. Um, I'm going to thank my friend Sarah Lee. She actually saw me using this little bitty planner that I was using for budget. And she was like, oh, you like planners. And I was like, oh, well, I, I, I like to do lists and stuff. And she was like, oh, well, I do planners. And I was like, oh, okay. But she said it with such enthusiasm that I just was like, hmm, there has to be more to a planner than just, you know, planning. And sure enough, she busted out the storyline that just made me amazed. And it just made me so excited to actually try getting into this world. So without further ado, um, you know, we're all in this quarantine stuff together, so I'm just going to say straight out that I did not go to a store and start shopping for this stuff. I actually did a curbside order because I was just really wanting to try to get into all this, but I'm very impatient. I didn't want to wait for it to arrive, so... I didn't wait for it to arrive. I went ahead and did this curbside. So buy online, pick up in the store. And thank you to my husband for being so giving because this is an expensive, expensive hobby. I'm like, I did a little research. I've watched a ton of videos. I've been super excited. And the more I watched, the more I fell in love with it. And lo and behold, there are so many, so many things that you can get into, but they all cost a lot of money. So bless his heart for putting up with me and letting me do me and allowing me to order all this stuff because let's just say with this pandemic going on, I really have just had a really, really tough week. Um, it's been a tough few weeks. I work in an environment that we are kind of front runners on dealing with the public and seeing all of the, the horror of people losing their businesses and just the uncertainty. It brings a very big realm of gratefulness, gratitude, um, it brings a realm of loving your family, being thankful to be alive. Uh, but it just really brings an awareness, period. Um, I don't want to get all deep into that because let me tell you, I will start crying and then this video will go into a different direction. And I don't want that. I want this video to be a happy moment because we are all stuck at home. And I know you guys are stuck at home too. So without further ado, I've talked for four freaking minutes about planners and about life but now let's see what they are so i'm going to start off with my very first planner that i bought this is called the happy planner and now i know a lot of you are going to be like yeah we're very aware of what this is let me point my little thing away get it out of the frame a little bit um, I know that, you know, most of y'all that are, that know about planners are definitely well aware of what planners are and all the fun stuff about them, but I don't. So bear with me. I want to kind of show you guys what I got and see if y'all like it. 
And then y'all can all leave comments on what I'm going to do with all of it because OMG, I'm excited. So this planner is going to be my video planner because I do my YouTube channel and I have some side projects that I really want to be better at as far as having the just my schedule down like I waste so much time like everything that I do I feel like I'm, I'm wasting time like there's so much that I want to do that I just don't have the time to do so as you can see you open the thing and it does say welcome and I'm assuming these are the owners of the happy planner because they sure look happy so I'm going to take that out and then oh my goodness look at this um, I'm going to slide this off and voila. And I love this. Like I love color. And you know, that was the first thing that Sarah Lee asked me was, well, what do you like? And I had to think about it. And you know, I like everything. Like I like so many things as far as color ranges, but in my soul, I really like bright colors. They just kind of make me happy. And it's kind of funny because it's mainly in stuff like this that I like color. When it comes to my everyday life, I'm a little gothy. So I really like dark colors like black and silver and dark purples and dark, 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 dark. Like I literally look like I'm going to a funeral every day when I get dressed. But anyways, so this is... Uh, and see, I don't even know what the accurate words for these are, other than really cool little pages that I can doodle on. And then it starts off in July, which is a few months from now, but I have a, a remedy for that because I need for it to start now. But I already figured out what I'm going to do about that. And I'm pretty sure y'all are going to have some cute word for it. And y'all probably already thought of it, but I'm trying to think of it too. So apparently when I was showing her my journal or my planner, she said I'm a vertical planner and I had no clue of what she was talking about. So then I started doing my research and lo and behold, vertical it is because I love having my dates. I love being able to plan through the day all the way down. Um, I've noticed that here I like doing like my work, my appointments, uh, you know, things that I need to do, uh, even bills that I need to pay. And then in this section, I like notating like that I have homework and then that night I'm going to do a video or, you know, whatever I have going on that I have to get done. And then down here, I usually do my meal planning. So if we're going to have Taco Tuesday, then... It's going to be on Taco Tuesday way over here where Tuesday is. Um, so, you know, it is kind of nice to be able to have a book. And I've noticed because I've always used a notebook and just wrote out my stuff, which is really, really ugly. Like, I mean, they look like hen scratch and I, I mean, but it's worked for me for years and I just never thought any deeper than a notebook. But then I discovered this little planner at the dollar store and, you know, shout out Dollar General, I think. And um, it kind of changed the way that I do it because it was laid out like this and that's what I found myself doing. So I'm kind of happy that there is a name for it and that I'm not crazy and that I can actually do it. So there's so much to show off. Um, I've actually looked up this one. There's really cute things in it oh that's really cute little look oh I don't know if you can see it but look that's so cute so that's really adorable but yeah so there's a lot of really pretty stuff in here and I just love the way it's separated and then I found some kits that I think I'm gonna try to add to them and that is so really pretty I really really like that the shininess. So, I mean, there's a lot of stuff. And this one's an 18-month planner, but I think I'm going to turn it into a 19, a 20-month planner or like a 21-month planner. 
because I do want to add the first three months to it so that I can start using it. And I didn't even realize that you could do that until I accidentally bought a set of blank calendars. And then I was like, oh, I could just pop these right in here. And I'm hoping that they're laid out right because I, again, didn't know what I was doing and I just ordered a bunch of stuff. So look at how beautiful that is. That is just really pretty. I love the shininess. Oh, look, squad goals. How cute. Yes. So I'm actually, I'm just so in love with it. I'm so excited. Give thanks. And the last one for December is fa la 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 la, which is so cute. So that's what I have for this one. But this is going to be my video planner and my like social media and just my activity based book that I really need to have a very strong goal with. So it's going to be more like a content book, which I will probably do some videos to show how I utilize it. Um, and then let me go ahead and bust out the bad boy. This is my favorite. So this one, this one is actually, so this one is actually a really cute one. And this is just so beautiful. Like I know I was telling you that colors kind of catch me. This one literally catches me. And this one, now I didn't know the other one had this little thingy, so I didn't even know to look for it. And this one didn't come with it, so I'm hoping nothing is missing, because that will just break my heart. And I haven't dove into these. Literally, y'all are seeing me open everything uh, for the first time. I did sneak a peek into this one just because it was like already open like that. But I didn't take that one off because I was like, you know what, I want y'all to see my first impression because I just don't know what I'm doing and I want y'all to witness me not knowing what I'm doing. So this is so cute. Again, it's at 18 months and it is vertical, I think. I hope. Color block layout. Oh, that's so cute. What did the other one say? Where did it go? Oh, look, it didn't say color block. Look, so I guess that's the difference is that this is vertical layout. This is color block. Oh, mercy. Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess that is. Yeah, that's vertical. What am I? I can't. I'm not even thinking. Duh, vertical. Okay, but look at the colors. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. I'm, I'm all about colors. Colors make me happy sometimes. And so again, another little welcome thing. What in the world did I just do? No, what did I do? Oh, okay. Y'all scaring me. Look, I just love the watercolor. Just anything like watercolor like this is just so pretty. I like the calendar layout. Oh, again with these little doodads. These are so cute. Um, Get through here. Look at how pretty that is. That is just so pretty. I really like it. And again, this one starts with July, August, September. Oh yeah, and then I guess it said the color blocking thing. <gasps> look, those are so pretty. Look, look, look. And then I like the way it has like the, these two are blank and then it has some workspace down here. So that's really cute. I forgot about that. So October, November, make today awesome. December, your potential is endless. Look at that. Oh, it's so pretty. January. February, look at the swirls of color. Like, it's just so beautiful. It literally looks like it was fresh painted. March. April. May, June, be filled with wonder. I, I find myself being drawn into the, the foil color. July, 
go with the flow. August again? You totally got this, of course. You totally got this. You guys listen, you totally got this, okay? Uh, make time to be kind. Yes, we all need to remember that. And you are beautiful. You guys, y'all are beautiful. Like, don't let nobody ever tell you nothing else. And do your best. And then to December, present over perfect. Okay. So, oh, and it does have some little notes in the back, I guess. I guess the back sheet was a note. So that's that. Uh-oh. Oh, no, I'm dropping stuff. Where did it go? Okay, I'll dig all that out in a minute. Um, I got these. Now, again, I'm pretty sure there's some pretty, like, like I was looking and I think one of these came out is like, I don't know, the spring edition or something. Like, I don't even know anything about the fancy smancy of it all. So tell me in the comments what each thing is. Like, if, if it's like one of the newest releases or did I get something old or whatever. I don't even care because to me they're gorgeous. I'm going based off of looks rather than like, oh, look, it's the new greatest thing. Um, And then these I fell in love with because I love stars. And these have like the star type of setup. And that's just so cute. And then look, these are all just little stars. And they're all little sprinkles of stars. I'm kind of wondering, I guess I'll do it since I have y'all on here. <laughs> okay. Okay, y'all, I'm peeling my first sticker. I feel like I'm failing at it. <gasps> oh my God, look. They're see-through. Oh yeah, they're see-through. See-through. So that means, I guess, let me see if I can put it back on here without making a big issue. Okay. Oh my goodness, it's see-through. I, I was That's what I was hoping for. I saw them on the thing and was kind of like looking at that. And look how pretty. See that the just the foil brings it out. And then like reflect, mantra, the best. You know, these are things that I need to remember. Like sometimes, I mean, uh oh, here I go dropping stuff. Uh oh, no, no, no. Y'all don't need to be in the video. My little nail brushes and stuff. I'm setting up my desk that I use for nails. So don't mind me. It's all messy. But like, you know, I love the to-do stuff. But like, reflect is something that sometimes you just need to remember it. Because you got to reflect on life. Especially with everything that's going on right now. It's so important to just remember. Like, keep going. You know, the best. Love more. Stay true. You know, sometimes just having those words around you make you, I don't know, they like subliminally make you happy. So anyways, so there's that one. It's really cute. Can't wait to try to use it. Now, when I'm doing my little videos about how, you know, I'm laying out everything, y'all please don't make fun of me because I just have a feeling they're not going to all be pretty. But I don't see how they couldn't be pretty with the set. Look, 290 pieces. Um, this is not, oh, it is Happy Planner, okay. Happy Planner, I think there's a couple things that I got that are not Happy Planner, but I guess we'll find out. Um, oh, so this is actually attached, why is this, what? I'm confused. Oh, I guess you can, okay, I don't get it. I really thought this was like a little divider thing, which is cool. It'll still pop into there. It'll be in there. It'll look cute. But look at these. Oh, the little mermaid scales and <gasps> huge mermaid scales and your limited edition. And oh my goodness. Oh, this is so cute. And I kind of like the pastel look. It's really kind of cute. I know Miss Sarah Lee was mentioning, uh, my friend was mentioning that she likes pastels and I 
I'm not really drawn to pastels, but then I think that I am because like this is pastel, but it's so pretty. But then I can see this with like some hot pinks and some purples too. So I guess I'm a weirdo. So I figured I love pens. I'm absolutely certain that I'm going to need pens. That's always the one thing that I have missing whenever I have my notebooks is that I have to dig a pen out of wherever just to get it to, to play on my notebook. And you know what? Here in a second, I'll actually show you my notebook. And y'all better not laugh at me. I'm not. Okay, you can laugh because you know what? It is really. This is a whole nother level of some stuff. Seeing this planner. I, I can't even lie to you. Like, I don't know how I never discovered these before. But look how cute is that. And I'll show y'all some pens that I just got to. So. But I don't know how I completely missed all that. And then I ordered these not realizing that I guess these are for the smaller book. Ah, oh, mini. Mini, 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 mini. Let me see. Is it recording? Yeah, it's recording. I hope this is recording, guys. But anyways, so back to my thing. So this is for the mini. And I didn't realize that it was for the mini. But you know what? I think it'll look kind of cute. I mean, it does have like a pretty massive difference in size. But like, I think if I separate it out a little bit. And I don't know. Let's look at it. If it's like a month by month thing. And I really am not sure what I got, honestly. Again, totally new. I'm like ignorant to this stuff. I just know these are here for a reason. So you can add stuff. So I'm really hoping that I can add some of this stuff. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Huh. I wonder if these are, let's see. Oh, one little divider for one little sheet. How cute though. Oh my goodness. It costs to be grateful for what you already have. Oh, look, and it does have a little calendar stuff. The do list. You know what? This will be perfect for a couple little areas. So are these all the same? Oh, okay. So, I mean, there's quite a few of these. So I guess I could separate these out into some of the, the months. Where did I have the most trouble? What could I, what could I, I improve this month? Or how, I don't even, I can't even read. What could I improve this month? What goals can I set for next month? Is it the same setup? Okay. It's looking like the same setup. Oh, it is maybe? Oh, it is. Okay. So I guess I could separate these out through a couple months. And I might even take them apart a little bit because honestly, I don't have this many bills. So like having the like one of these sheets would be fine. So I bet I could literally put one of these sheets in each month and kind of like just splice it all up and make it work. And then I really like these cute little dividers. So I'm guessing these are all going to be the same way. I wonder what's after the seven. Oh, look, you are not different. Hmm. But it feels like there's more stuff back here. So, oh my goodness. Look, there's some stickers. Look at the stickers, guys. Look at the stickers. Oh, how cute. Wait, why are you stuck? Hard work, treat yourself. How cute are these? Sorry if I'm talking too much, guys. I'm just, I usually do voiceovers. I never talk in my videos. Oh, look, and it has a little folder. That's cute. And I, I could actually move that week by week, I bet. Probably wear out the little thing, but hmm. Okay, so good. 
I am so glad that I did invest into that one. And then I know I got another budget thing, but it looked super plain and this one was super bright. So I just felt the need to, you know, be so extra and order this one too. And like I said, you couldn't go into Michael's. It was like curbside. I did go into pay, but like with curbside, you have to order it on their website. And so I ordered it on their website and then had them like, you know, get it all together for me. So I really couldn't see what I was ordering other than what it said on the thing. And some of the things were not that descriptive. Like they didn't like that one. I don't think that one said mini. I, I really don't think that it said mini. Um, this one, I think it's just filler paper. Um, so, and it's just this colors. So I'm not going to open these, but look, those are the three colors or the four colors. And it looks like they have different patterns on them. So that's kind of cute. So I'll probably just add those throughout each month. So I have some, some space to take notes because I do like taking notes. That's kind of the thing that I like about my notebook, which again, I will show you. I always have like some kind of to-do list thing growing, goals list or whatever, somewhere in my notebook. So I will bust that out so that y'all can see that. And, you know, I really don't, I don't know what this is. Hold on. Um. Oh, this is the calendar extension. Okay, so both of these, this one is going to be my all. This one's going to be my all. Uh, so this is going to be my everyday appointments and um, the way that I have my other little planner, I'm probably going to just keep that one for work so I can just throw little notes into it. But this one's going to be my catch all for everything. Um, I've, I, I've seen people doing multiple. I did watch a few videos. So as much as I don't know what I'm doing, I kind of am gaining an idea of what I want to do. So this is going to be my catch-all. I'm going to probably divide these into what I need them to be. Again, I like having my appointments at the top, my bills at the top um, for that week, which usually ends up my bills somewhere over here. Um, but, you know, my catch-all is really like my appointments up here. Um, I have homework because I am a student, so I still do a ton of homework. And this will make it easy so that I can just put my assignments in here that I need to do. Um, which helps me break up my week the way I need. Plus, I can also be like, okay, so today is Friday. Um, I'm off from doing videos, but I'm sitting here doing a video. Um, but I'm going to be doing video posts on Tuesdays and Thursdays generally for my nails. And then I want to expand and maybe do something like this. Uh, and fit that in the calendar somewhere, but I need my days to record. And then I also need um, my content and that's why I want my other book. Uh, but these will at least be like, okay, so tonight I'm doing videos. Like tonight, this night I'm recording, this night I'm recording, but then Monday, Wednesday, and Friday I'm doing homework. That way I can find a balance because I don't have balance. I'm like all over the place 100% of the time. And then at the bottom, I'm going to do, you know, our dinners because if I know that I have the week of dinner planned, then I know Wednesday night's pork chops, then usually Tuesday I'll pull out the pork chops because it's already in my head that I have it scheduled. I'm not thinking Wednesday, oh my God, what am I going to go home and cook? Like I literally already know Tuesday so I can already have it prepared so I can throw it in the oven Wednesday or however. So that's going to help me a lot. Um, anyways, back to more stuff. So again, that's what I want. I think I'm going to add these in between some of these just to have my notes. Um, I don't know. How do y'all do it? Um, I mean, I think it's a good idea. Let me know if y'all find different ways that things function and how y'all like them. And then with the calendar extension, I want to add the three months at the beginning of each one of these because it's March right now. So I still have April, May, and June before it even hits July. So these, if it's six months, which I think it is six months, 
it's six month extension. So then I can literally do three months of this and one and three months of this and the other. And voila. And I think it comes with all the little numbers. So, but we're fixing to find out. It looks like it has the little dividers for it. So that's even better. That's pretty exciting. And I'm guessing I can reuse the dividers, which is pretty cool. So, oh, look, how cute is this? Oh, okay, so it is pretty much kind of, ah, okay, so it gives you the whole calendar. Now, are these the vertical ones? Yes. Somehow, I lucked out because I don't like the other ones. I just, I don't know what it is. I'm just not a, what is it, horizontal? I'm not a horizontal mama. I'm a vertical mama. Ooh, and this is kind of cute. Look, reading, planning, watching, cooking. Huh. Birthdays, that's a good idea, which I saw those on the other ones. So dots, more dots. Um, is this one? <gasps> Ooh, my soul is in the black and white. I love black and white stripe. Some days you just have to create your own sunshine. Ooh, stripes, stripes, stripes. I love them. And then gold dots. And then the last of everything. Let's see, is there anything fancy? I don't know. Oh, look. Okay, I forgot about these. Oh, that's a ton of stickers too. But man, those are just all black and white. I don't know about that. I mean, I like me some black and white, but that's a whole lot of black and white. Um, but I mean, I guess spaced out, you're not going to notice. So cute. You know, it's kind of cool though, is that it has two Februarys. So I can literally label the things the way that I need to, like, it'll be enough that I have enough for two kits of the months that I need. So because I need March, I need April, May, and June. So then I can use these on something else, I guess. Oh, and look how pretty. Aww. Now those there's only one of, but yeah, I'm not going to cry. That's meant because this is supposed to be a six month extension, I guess. Not, you know, the way I'm fixed the busted up. But yeah, so this is really neat. I'm so excited. How were y'all feeling when you first discovered this? Like, what got you guys to discover it? What was your first time exploring into the deep world of planners? Hit me up in the comments below. Let me see if I'm good enough let's see I don't think I am guys I don't think I am I'm really not oh look at that and you know what honestly I am gonna do that because I am literally about to put these in here so I might actually even record a second video showing y'all me putting it together okay so on to more things and yes there is more there is more I got a second budget thing now this one, I guess cool enough, came out the right size. So it does say, does it say, does it say, yes, fit classic. So apparently that matters. I guess these are the classic size of everything. So now maybe I won't be grabbing the, you know, mini size. But I think I got, I did get another mini item, but I guess we will live or no. Yeah, I haven't opened that one. Okay. So this is more budget stuff. Um, it looks like it comes with some stickers too. It says stickers monthly calendar pages. So I wonder if this does go through one, two, three, four, five, six, seven dividers. So I'm wondering if this is like a seven month thing. If so, I'll just, you know, kind of combine it with the other one that's like a six month and make that work. Um, I'll probably show these more whenever 
actually start working on it in here. So we'll, we won't open that one. I want to get to this one and I don't want y'all to be on here for 50 years and it's already 34 minutes. Y'all are probably tired of hearing me talk. I don't blame you. Um, oh my glob. <gasps> Look how cute this little baby is. Look, it's like a little mini. It's like, it's like tiny. Oh my goodness, they're little sticky. <gasps> they're sticky notes. Look how cute that is. Oh my goodness. Okay, sorry. I got a little kid out like... This is really cute. So that's like a little divider. This will work really well for, and I don't know if you can see, but it has these really pretty stripes and a really cute heart. And then I don't even know what this thing is for, but we're gonna figure it out. Oh, look, it came with a little divider. Oh, another little envelope thing. Keep it all together, which this is good because I do need something to kind of keep certain little things in. And look, little stickers. Oh, look at this paper. It comes with Pippella. Oh. oh, how cute is that? And it says Dreamer. So I'm pretty sure I'll find a way to incorporate this in. Um, or I might end up just having to buy me a mini, guys. I don't know. Do y'all think that I could use a mini and shove it in my purse? Maybe, possibly. Let's maybe see if we could do that. So this is 542 pieces, but geez, they, it feels huge. So I'm just going to kind of flip through it. So I'm not really one for ribbons. Um, but from what I see in some of the groups, y'all kind of gift each other things. So like, you know, if there's certain things that I ever say that I don't like, Hit me up and maybe we could do a trade or something. Huh, 90% coffee, 10% dry shampoo. That's really funny. That's really cute. So these are pretty, they're little smart remarks. They're hilarious. That's cute. Uh, wine plus dinner equals winner. That's so funny. Today has been canceled. I think everybody feels that right now. Today has literally been canceled. But, oh, look how cute. It's like little cuss things. That's my whole life right there. The erasers. Look. I mean, it's really just little words, I guess. So, I don't know if I'm winning with this one. Let me see. I mean, I'm sure there's some cute, really cute stuff to decorate with. But this is mainly, it just looks like really funny sayings. Like sassy plans. I guess that makes sense because those are some sassy little things. And then uh, stickers. Now this one's Craft Mart. Hmm. I'm guessing this is one of the only things that I got that wasn't exactly what I, you know, like Happy Planner brand. But I, I'm not like a dedicated person. I saw a lot of different options for brands. Uh, whenever I was kind of researching a little bit and look at that, look at the hollow. Um, I don't think I'm going to be a faithful person. I mean, but then I don't know. I don't really know. I don't think that it matters where stickers come from. This one's really cute. Look at the hollow. But so I don't really think that stickers necessarily matter where they come from. If they're cute, they're cute. Um, I do like the style of the Happy Planner because I love those little disc whatever thingies they are. Um, I, I did learn that word. Um, but I really like, I don't know, I just like everything. Look at all the, like, the foils, dude. The foils just do it for me. Oh, look. Oh. I'm all like, I got sidetracked. Look at it. But let me see. Look at the little rainbows. <gasps> look at the little rainbows. They're cute. But yeah, so, I mean, I just, I don't know. I like this one. This one's really cute. Not bad for not being, I mean, I don't know. I think Craftsmart's just like a, probably a freaking Michaels brand or something. It's kind of like when you go to the store and you get 
the the off brand but hey these are really cute look at the gold and then i have one more thing that it fell let me see what it was oh okay this one is recollections and i'm bumping everything okay so this one actually has a seal let me see How do you open this stuff? Should I peel this or should I cut it? Oh my gosh. What in the world? They made it adult proof, guys. It's like literally adult proof. The what? Ten minutes later. Ugh. Yuck. Okay, that was a nightmare. Oh, look, all the little emojis. That's pretty cute. And then, oh, these are cute and they're shiny. Don't forget. Okay, so this is, I think it says goals stickers. I'm all about the goals, important, remember, well done, bill do, busy days. Like, this is actually pretty cute. Oh, yay, foils. I love the foils, guys. Love them. Okay, so this one's going to actually be pretty cute, and these are actually shiny, so they're pretty adorable. I'm trying to slow down so y'all can actually see them. So I don't know if any of y'all have seen these before. I'm pretty sure you have. I'm so new at this that I don't know what I'm doing. So I'm just showing y'all everything. But okay, so this is what I got. If I'm missing anything, if there's something that you feel like I'm just going to definitely need, let me know because I definitely want to see what I definitely am going to need. Um, but before I let y'all go, I'm actually grabbing my ugly little notebook. Now this one I had stole from my daughter, so it actually has her name. But literally it's just an ugly notebook. But here's kind of, because I want to do it by my pay period and paydays and stuff. So I literally was just like, okay, so... These start off being like what I owe on this or that. And then I just start moving along and I'm like, okay, well, I really need to pay this. I really need to pay that. And then I start doing it like this where I'm like my paydays. And then these are all my paydays plus my husband's paydays, but they're by the, the dates. So 2-7, 2-14, 2-21, 2-22, 2-23. So you get the gist. Look how ugly it is. It's just so fugly, but it just works for me. And I've been doing these for years. Like this one, you can see this one I had just started when I started at um, the, the job that I'm doing right now. So I literally, I started it uh, in January. But look at this, like I literally did it for like months. So it's like, and then I kind of redid it because I didn't like the way that it was. So I actually did it all the way out for like almost a year, but I didn't like it because I wasn't using a pencil. So I wasn't able to erase and stuff. So then you'll see a lot of scribbles. You'll like, you'll see a lot of scribbles and stuff to where I'm just like, okay, maybe I should have used pencil. So I've learned a lot. I mean, I do, I've always done this type of stuff and then I love doodling on stuff. So yeah, but so I love doing this kind of stuff. So I really can't wait to dive into this. I just didn't know it was such a cult following. Like it's like now that I found, now that I found it on YouTube, 
it's like it's everywhere. So I'm really happy. If you see me in any of the Facebook groups, be sure and say hi. Um, my name is Lisa, and I'll be so happy to say hi to you back. And then um, my channel, I generally do nail videos. So y'all are welcome to stick around and watch nail videos. Um, but I think I'm going to go ahead and do a set of videos like this like maybe once a week or something. I mean, I don't really know. So I just kind of wanted y'all to see my, my growth in this and see me discover something new. So anyways, I hope it entertains one of you guys, but I will talk to y'all later. I'm going to get off of here. Bye guys.